how are you all doing welcome back to my channel Jane one zero's lifestyle I trust you're all doing well and keeping safe and so today I thought I'm going to come and show you share with you how I do a, a recipe pinto bean recipe so it's very very tasty and this recipe is going to require peanut butter and it's going to require some sweet potatoes it's very easy to make very tasty and I'm going to be making mine with some uh, brown rice on the side if you want to have anything extra you can do that so I have some of the ingredients already here prepped so I'm just gonna list them down below on my uh, description if you want to check them out and if you want to try out the recipe please do and do let me how it turns out so I have my pan there warming up already so I'm gonna go ahead and start cooking my um, pinto beans hopefully you enjoy this recipe and if you do like it don't forget to let me know how it turns out so for the ingredients here I have uh, coriander cilantro dania I have some sweet potatoes I have two uh, onions I have some chili uh, fresh chili if you don't like chili you can omit it I have here gin uh, garlic and ginger paste so it's already in oil I have chopped tomato so I'm using an organic chopped tomato I'm using cold press uh, rapeseed oil that's the oil of my choice and I'm going to be using peanut butter as well so if you have a different peanut butter you can use that and these are my pinto beans that I soaked last night and cooked them this morning and I'm just going to be adding a little bit of cayenne pepper to it just to give it a little bit of a, a taste and I'm going to be adding some smoked paprika as well just for added color so those are all mostly most of my ingredients that I'm going to use and I have a, a, a vegetable bouillon so I'm going to try and say this is my vegetarian uh, take on some pinto beans I'm gonna add some oil maybe two two to three tablespoons and in your onion I'm going to add in my ginger and garlic I'll add in my bouillon and in some paprika I'm going to add some curry powder, a teaspoon of curry powder. to add in my cayenne pepper I'm going to add in my peanut butter so what I did to make it more 
watery is that I just added the, a few tablespoons of cold water. Do not add hot water to it. Add cold water and then uh, mix it in. So this is two tablespoons of peanut butter. Reduce the heat now. So my food has finally finished cooking and it looks amazing and it tastes really really good so everything is nicely incorporated and everything just tastes so good so I am going to leave this for a little while just to simmer very slowly and then uh, later on before I serve it up I'm going to add in some I'm going to add in some green beans to it just to give something green into the dish and so yeah so that's my pinto bean with peanut butter uh, recipe if you want to give it a try please do and as you saw it's very easy to make very quick to make and thank you all for watching until next time keep watching Jane on Jero's lifestyle bye for now